Oh, hey, there you are. Hey, listen, I got something really cool I want you to see. What is it? This. I found it in the yard. A tennis ball. That's very impressive, Brian. Yeah, but don't tell the other dogs in the neighborhood. They'll be jealous. You son of a bitch. And this is nothing. There's one tennis ball out there that's even cooler because I peed on it. Buried it years ago. I just can't remember where. I'd give anything to find it, though. Well, if you could recall exactly when you buried it, I suppose I could help you out. I remember the exact day. January 31st, 1999. Very well. Follow me, Brian. Watch out for Ernie. He's getting a CAT scan. <laughs> Here we are. That's odd. It's our house, but somehow it looks a little different. Mom, my lips are too thin. Can I please get collagen injections? Meg, you don't need to change the way you look. You know, most of the world's problems stem from poor self-image. Oh my god, what's with Meg's voice? She sounds like someone who's about to give up a huge opportunity. That's nothing. Look at you. You look like a prize at some Mexican church carnival. Excellent. The mind control device is nearing completion. Stewie, I said no toys at the table. Damn you, vile woman! You've impeded my work since the day I escaped from your wretched womb. Oh, don't pout, honey. You know, when you were born, the doctor said you were the happiest looking baby he'd ever seen. But of course, that was my victory day. The fruition of my deeply laid plans to escape from that cursed ovarian Bastille. Return the device, woman. Jeez, what'd you carry a thesaurus around with you? You know, it's amazing I could speak at all with that circumcision still healing. Hey, wait a minute, Stewie, that's the spot. That's where I buried my tennis ball. <laughs> whoa, 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 Brian, what are you doing? You can't dig it up here. Just make a mental note of where you buried it, and as soon as we're back in the present, you can dig it up then. Why? Because we can't risk doing anything that alters the past. You know, I never got that. I mean, wouldn't you want to alter the past? I mean, you could make life better for yourself. And, and not just for yourself, for everyone. You, you could... Stop 9-11. Brian, there's one rule of time travel, and that is, do not alter the past in any way or the consequences could be dire. Yeah, where'd you hear that? Quantum Leap. That guy changed the past all the time. Whoa, ass ahoy. Hey, uh, Peter, it's 7 o'clock and you've still got your pants on. What's the occasion? Ew, I remember this. Peter's eye did that weird creepy thing where it went over his nose. Come on, you're worrying about nothing. Oh, remember when you got drunk off the communion wine at church? Ah, ew, gross. Look at that. Wait, what are they doing? I don't know, they're just standing there like zombies. Do you think they're all right? I, I'm, I'm not sure. And then there was that time at the ice cream store. They're doing it again, what the hell? I, I, I'm at a loss. I mean, I, I know we're not supposed to mess with the timeline, but should we call an ambulance? That is so creepy. And remember you had an Irish coffee the day we went to see Philadelphia? Oh, they're, they're, do, they're setting up cutaways. Oh, my God. Is that what we did back then? Yeah, I mean, now we just, like, return text messages and screw around and whatnot. Lois, I'm not going back to work tomorrow. That new boss has it in for me. He's meaner than a shifty salesman. You sure you got time to smoke? Oh, yeah. It's an Al Harrington. It goes on for a while. All right, look, we found out where your ball is buried. Now let's get back to our own time. Okay, get the return pad. Let's go. Not out here in the open. Someone could see us. Remember, no altering the timeline. Come on, let's get up to my room. Hey, wait a minute, Stewie. I gotta take a leak. W will it screw up the timeline if my future pee goes in a past toilet? Uh, no, as long as it goes in the toilet. One splash on a magazine in there and we're getting chased by dinosaurs. Huh, looks more or less the same. Oh, my God, my Japanese children's books. I forgot about these. You poop now. Horton hears a suicide. The little engine that will or get great shame. Oh, there you are. All right, come on, Brian, let's get out of here. Blast that draggle-tailed, blunt-edged, matriarchal despot. Who the deuce does she think she is? <gasps> Quick, Brian, hide. I shall cleverly disguise this lethal plasma disrupted device as a tuna fish sandwich, whereupon I shall end that wretched woman's draconian reign of tyranny. <gasps> oh, hey. Who the deuce are you? Uh, well, I'm, uh, I'm you. You look like me, but that's utterly impossible. I'm afraid it's true. I'm you from the future. I've traveled back in time. 